Together, let us bring our prayers before God. God who made us, your steadfast love endures from generation to generation. For the ever renewing beauty of your creation and the songs of praise sung by choirs and congregation, rising mountains and shining stars, voiced by birds and bubbling up from running streams, we give you thanks. By your loving power, make the work we do, the words we say, the decisions we make, reflect your generous love and bring glory to your name. Christ who shepherds us, you have called us by name and sought us when we are lost. You have fed us when we are hungry, protected us when we are afraid, and offered us rest when we are weary. We pray your tender care for those who this day are grieving, for those who are sick, and for those who hunger for food. Yes, for food, but also for justice, for friendship, for peace. We pray for those who live in the shadow of war and natural disaster. Shelter them from harm and bring them to a place of peace where lives can be rebuilt and hope renewed. We thank you, Lord, for those who sing when we cannot. We thank you, Lord, for those who seek to serve as you have served us for those who care for the sick, who protect the powerless, who feed the hungry, for those who teach the children, who stand up against injustice, who welcome the stranger, who pray without ceasing. We pray for them strength and courage when they are weary and discouraged. We thank you for the vision they offer us of your gracious, reconciling, and compassionate kingdom. Spirit that dwells within us, move among us, inspire us to live in harmony as your people. Guide those who make decisions in homes, in our church, in communities, in our nation and world. Make us bold witnesses of the good news in our words and in our deeds, and make our very lives a song of praise. For we pray these prayers in the name of Christ, who taught us how to live and how to pray, saying, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen.